Yeah. Are the solar flares analogous to how you could use iron filings to see the field of a horseshoe magnet, say? Yeah, that's another way of... So in other words, the, the plasma is actually following the, um, the magnetic field, so just the same way as iron filings do when you put a, put a piece of paper on a horseshoe mm -hmm. magnet and mm -hmm. sprinkle it. That's a little more. Are you indicating that the, the temp, high temperatures do to the sunspots then? They appear above sunspots. So does, yes. the, does the temperature vary with the solar cycle then? Yes, uh, yes, it will vary. But remember, these sunspots, they're localized regions. So if you look at the visible light coming from the sun, it doesn't change much due, due, during the solar cycle. What does change is the amount of X-rays and ultraviolet coming from the sun, OK? Because they mostly come from the corona. And this is basically the X-ray corona during uh, typical solar max. And this is how it changes over the solar cycle. So during solar minimum, when there are no sunspots, the X-rays coming from the corona is X-ray flux is very, very small. But then during solar max, it increases substantially, a few orders of magnitude. So most of the X-rays come during the solar maximum conditions. <clears throat>